he is such an asshole. Like, obviously something was wrong because I was doing those loud exhales, you know, when you're in bed and you're like pretending you're asleep. Anyway, um, yeah, I'll call you back. Okay. Georgie, we are so super stoked to have you on board. Um, I just really wanted to go over some like specific sales techniques that we have here. Oh my god, like fire away because I'm such a fast learner. <laughs> That's good. Well, first of all, tomorrow you'll need to dress better. Yeah, I mean, what you've got on is cute. Thank you. What I was supposed to say is that it isn't cute. Yeah, but we do have a staff rack actually out back and it's full of all these expensive, beautiful, amazing clothes that customers will really want to buy, but they're not actually available in store. So it kind of messes with their head, which is, you know, kind of the whole vibe that we're going with. I'm just not sure if we have anything in your size. But anyway, another thing. So here we really go out of our way to make sure that our customers feel like as insecure as possible. So if someone has a question, the best thing to do is just kind of zone out and really ignore them. Oh. Excuse me, do you have this in a size 10? Sorry, do you have this in a size 10? I'll just try to fit into this. See, and it works like every time. Another thing that you can do is actually like approach the person and be like, hey hun, how are you doing? And you can kind of stand back and just like look them up and down from like head to toe, judging them and like the decisions that they've made in life. Yeah, it's taking me a while though, because I guess for me though, I really try and focus in on problem areas and it's just like, you have so many, that's why it takes so long. It just so. makes me feel very sad. <laughs> yeah, it makes me feel really good though. Another thing that we have, when you go in the changing rooms, the mirrors there are actually fun house mirrors that we got from an abandoned circus. Oh, sweetie, it looks like you might need a bigger size. <laughs> Maybe two sizes bigger. <laughs> Oh, see, and what we've done there is we've actually cut off the curtain because public shaming is not only super popular, but it also helps with an upsell. I'll probably get at least a beach towel out of her for this. <laughs> so one other thing that I really like to do if somebody's card declines is actually turn all the music in the store right down, just like that, and then you go... I'm so sorry, but your card declined. No, mum, no, that wasn't me. I work here, so... Well, <laughs> it's just a trial. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, look at that. That's good timing. Um, so I'm going to leave you to your own devices now with this customer. Good luck and remember everything that I taught you. Good luck. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Do I have the job? Yeah, you totally got the job. Ow.